Hello, my name is Cortlin from EPC, and today I'll be showing you how to tear down this Microsoft Go 3 tablet. You can use the same process with the Go 2 model and the Go 4. Overall, it is a fairly simple task as long as you are attentive to detail and have patience. Let's get into it. So first things first, in the process, you want to start by heating up the tablet. I have my tablet here set on 70 degrees Celsius. What this does will loosen the adhesive and make removing the screen much easier. Once it's up to heat or up to temperature, you wanna start in the speaker grills because that is the only spot that you'll be able to get under the screen. You want to make sure to keep your tool flat and not at an angle because if you go at an angle, it could possibly chip your screen and just make sure not to go too deep and start working your way around the edge of the case. I also like to keep my devices on so that I can see the screen and make sure that I'm not damaging the digitizer. But this one's dead. Go nice and slow. Make sure, especially in the bottom left side corner to be extra slow and gentle because the ribbon cables for the display are there. And if you damage those, the entire screen will be non reusable. If you need to, you can come out of the speaker grill and re enter on the other side. And just nice and slow, loosen that. Work your way to the top. If you notice where I have my blade, it's aligned where the edge of the point just hidden under the case on the glass. And I like to go around a second time to make sure that I loosen all the adhesive that I did not catch the first trip. At this point, you can start trying to pop up the screen. I go back into the grill and go down to maybe the bottom corner, either corner will work. And I just lightly push up to where the screen is separated. And the last part, the top near the camera, I usually use this tool to separate it. Once I get it started, you just lightly push down and pop back and it starts to separate. And in no time, sometimes if it starts struggling or it's not as easy, you want to go back through with your tool to loosen any adhesive you may have missed. But after that, you have your screen separated. And you want to make sure to handle this gently and remove the cover for the screen porch and then you can remove the screen like so. Now we are ready to remove the motherboard from the tablet. Firstly, I always start by removing the antenna right here across the top. The removal of the board is simple. All you need is a screwdriver with a Phillips screw bit. Make sure to keep your screws neat so you know where they come from and makes reassembly a lot easier. All right, and just like that, your antenna is gone. Next, we can move down to any screws that you see. I'm going to start here with the heat sink. And 
and then this top part will remove you can set that aside next you need to remove some of these black covers because they will reveal screws that need to be removed to get the board out like there's not one there so we can leave that one on but there is one here and removing these is as simple as slightly propping upward and i believe there's one here Not one here, there's one there. I'm gonna... Firstly, I'm just going to continue to remove all visible screws. And I'm going to disconnect these ribbon cables from their connectors. Which is as simple as lifting the tab gently removing those should be a few screws under here this is the housing where the all the camera devices are and you can simply unscrew these two which are keeping the rear camera intact. All right, and I think we have a few more. Maybe one here. No. If you're not sure, you can also give the board a little wiggle. Uh, there's some here where the battery connect there is. Also, do not forget to disconnect the speaker here. And I just like to use my tool to loosen it and then I grab a hold of the wiring and simply pull up backwards like that. There's another connector right next to for the speaker. removed like so as well now I'm going to wiggle the board and see where or I see another screw actually and just like that a little more wiggle camera seem to be holding it down but you can remove those by gently pushing at an angle upward just disconnecting from the adhesive that's holding them down I'm going to try to remove this and just like that you have the breakdown of the Microsoft Surface Go 3. Don't feel like doing a teardown yourself? Have not just one, but hundreds of devices taking up space? EPC is a global leader in the iTad field, and it's our goal to reduce e-waste and give devices a second chance. Reach out to us today to learn more.